Hello and welcome to this new video. I am Manzur Wani, the author of WP Telegram plugins. In this video, I am going to show you how you can bypass the ban on Telegram imposed by different hosts, especially if they are located in Russia or Iran. Here I have WP Telegram plugin installed and set up. If you don't know how to do that, you can go and watch my previous video that's here so you can set it up now if i click on test token my host will not allow the request to go to telegram so i have to wait for 20 odd seconds for the request to fail so when the when the request completes i will see an error here which actually means my host blocks telegram and then we can find a solution to bypass that ban. So you can see here it is error 500, which basically means my host blocks Telegram. So now let's get rid of this error. So you have the proxy module here. If you activate the proxy module, you should have these many proxy methods available. We have added a new method called Cloudflare Worker. So in this video, I am going to show you how we can use Cloudflare workers to bypass this ban. I'm going to choose Cloudflare worker as my proxy method. And then I need this Cloudflare worker URL. All right. And here instructions are given on this link. So if I click on the link, it will open a new tab. I have these instructions given here. So first step is to go to Cloudflare dashboard. I'm going to open a new tab. And then you need to sign in or sign up. I have already created an account, so I'm going to log in. When you log in, it may ask you to add a website. All right, so you need to, you can ignore that. So it will say this, so you can ignore that. You directly need to go to this, workers. So when I click on workers, it will ask you to set up subdomain. So you can give any name you want, or you can use the existing one which is pretty fine so i'm going to use the default one and click on setup all right then you can continue with the free plan which should be more than enough all right so we can continue with the free plan and we need to verify the email all right so i have not verified my email address so i'm going to resend email all right so i'm going to check my mail Okay, we have the email, so I have verified my email address. All right. Now we are in the workers section. So you need to click on this, create a worker. Here we go. So you have the worker ready for editing. So when you create a worker, you need to edit it. Then set a short name for your worker and to shorten the URL. So you have this short name here. If you want to change it, for example, I am going to name it as bypass telegram ban. Okay, so I'm going to press enter. So now the URL has changed. All right. Now, what do I, what do I need to do? I need to copy the code from index.js file, which is here. All right. So I'm going to click on this file. I'm going to copy the code here. All right. Then I'm going to go to the worker and I am going to select all here and press delete. And now I am going to paste using my keyboard. All right. So I have pasted the code here. And now when this is successful, you should see this error message here, no matching route found. So I am going to go ahead and save and deploy. When this is done, you need to copy this URL here. All right. So you need to copy this URL. And then you copy this URL and you need to paste it here. All right. So here I'm going to paste this URL. All right, so just save changes after that. And that is it. You are done. So if I test token now, see what happens. 
there you go. We have successfully bypassed the ban on Telegram as simple as that.